What's good, y'all? Welcome back to another one. Starting off with more authentic shooting. Shooting also gets some nice upgrades from NBA 2K23. And NBA 2K22 success from the outside was heavily weighed towards coverage. If you could get an open look, you could balance out poor ratings and inaccurate timing. This year, we wanted a more authentic shooting model that captures the essence of great NBA shooter shooter's capability. The first major changes is, is the addition of shooting attributes. Since the inception of signature jump shots in 2K basketball, animations have been more or less aesthetic, but functionally all the same. This year, each signature jump shot has a unique shooting. This year, each signature jump shot has unique shooting stats that help determine its effectiveness. So first shoot shot speed, how quickly the shot gets to its ideal release point. Um, release height, how high the jump shot is released. Defensive immunity, how effective the shot is against defensive contest. This is gonna be a big, but I'm sure everybody's gonna want defensive immunity pretty high. Um, timing impact. Just shot windows to reward good timing at all cost of an increased penalty for a bad timing. I like that. Um, we're also adding a huge number of shot animations to choose from over double the amount of any previous version of 2K. And they're so much more accurate to each player's real life jumper. For my player's shot animations, you will be gated by sh shot ratings. It's a great innovation. Um, but you, I'm talking, let's say if Curry's is just ridiculous, like the shot speed is quick as fuck. The release height is not that high. Um, the defensive immunity is like amazing. Um, and the timing impact is like just a little bit slightly above, you know, middle ground. That's not what you want. Uh, if you, you know, have an 80, um, three point you don't want that just sitting at an 83 point you want that animation you want that sitting at like a 95 or like a i don't know like a 90 set like i need i need there to be a amazing distinction between that and that's going to have a real impact on are these animations redundant you're gonna have everybody using the same move or the same shot we also have some uh nba 2k23 shot meters let's look at these here and right away I can see the bar at the, the bottom and the top of the green. Make sure if y'all enjoyed this video, make sure y'all like and subscribe. I know you sitting here watching this video and you not subscribed. You for real, bro?